Hello there, Yenniers. It's me, Krimpo, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a simple party dance floor like this. So, the first step is go to DIY and choose your prepared shape. In this video, I choose the circle shape to become my main spawn point. Adjust it depends on you. After you adjusted it, go to properties and change the color of it. After that, go to properties and go to add component and look for trigger component. After you add the trigger component, go to add component again and look for the spawn point component. After that, go to DIY again and look for a square board shape. This square board shape will represent as your party dance floor. After you add the square board shape, adjust it and change the color of it depends on you. And also, change the texture into self-illuminating, just like in the video. After you adjust it and change the color and texture, copy and change the color of each square board shape into different colors. After that, tap your spawn point and go to properties. Look for trigger and tap the cross sign. Tap it four times just like in the video. The properties of your spawn point should be like this. After that, tap the first two and tap the edit. And then, get these scripts and drag it to your own trigger enter. Follow the steps just like in the video. After that, tap the first zero and set it into one. And then, tap the operator and set it into not equal and tap the second zero and set it into one. In this part, tap the get.world.object and then select the red square board and then press OK. Next, tap the property, group, and then scroll down and tap the color and check. And change the color into yellow. After that, change the value of wait 0 seconds into 1. And then, copy and paste the second code 3 times. After you copy it 3 times, insert it inside the keep loop until code and then change their color in different colors. After that, copy the wait 1 second 3 times and then insert it inside the keep loop until just like in the video. After you finish this step, go to home, tap your spawn point, go to properties, and then go to second do trigger. After that, do the same process like what we did on the first do trigger. Or you can follow the steps just like in the video for your references. A few moments later. So, for the last step, let's test our mini script if our party floor is working. 
Ta-da! Now you can create your own creative party floor. <laughs> so, that's for today's video, Unioners. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and click the notification bell to always update you in my upcoming videos. Thank you for watching.